2017 Apache Invitational with Britton Reynolds, Valencia High School in Valencia, third place individually in the sweepstake race. Time was around 14.47, I believe it was. Yeah. Time-wise, this course is very, very fast. It was a very good field of individuals. What was your plan coming in? How did it play out for you? Um, the goal of this race was really the team battle. Um, cool. We had a series of, I think, disappointing performances for us and where we were last season. Um, and so this this race we were looking at, and we were like, we need to get ranked, you know, to get in the CIF and stuff. So, um, yeah, our, our coach took us aside. He told us, like, look, this race is going to be either the road to state or, you know, it could be where it ends here, you know, if we can't make it out of league. So so we all just came together and we were like, okay, this is it, you know. This could be the race that gets us to postseason. So um, individually, I was just looking, you know, to score those points and stuff um, and just, you know, just do, do as well as I could. I mean, that was really it. And uh, so, yeah, that was, that was mainly the plan going to this race was to do well as a team. So coming in, you mentioned about the whole thing about being ranked and such. There were a couple of good teams in here. Tribuca Hills and you guys, that was going to be really key as far as that CIF ranking, which opens the yeah. door for getting us that large because it's a tough league. Coming in, did you guys feel pumped? Did you guys feel pressure, nervous, or a whole mix of everything? Um, maybe a little bit of everything, but we were pretty pumped, you know, we're like, man, the weather's really good. We raced here at a fastback, you know, just the two-mile course in the opposite direction earlier, so we know what it's like. Um, I mean, yeah, we were nervous definitely because, you know, this is the race that really counts. There's a lot of pressure in that aspect, but I think we were just really pumped because we were all like, okay, this is it, guys. We need to uh, step up our game, and it's night. It feels good. The weather's great. Fast course. So, yeah, I think it was we were really just pumped for it, but we were definitely a little bit nervous as well. Now, personally, individually, I know you've had a real nice break through the last year and a half. Excellent senior season. You've been doing some recruiting <laughs> trips in the sense, so I know mm -hmm. that, can, that, can, that can wear on people when they travel a lot. How do you feel right now with the postseason around the corner physically? you feel pretty rested, pretty tired? Um, Honestly? I, I, <laughs> I would say I'm a little tired definitely from all the travel and stuff. I mean, last week I did six days of college tours straight wow. in two different states. I did a two-day tour in Utah, flew back the night before my race, raced at City of Angels, and then flew out to Boston for like four or five days. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to lie, I'm a little tired, but... Um, going into league finals, which is this coming Thursday, I'm um, going to get a lot of sleep, you know, and we'll begin, you know, hopefully the tapering phase of our training. And uh, yeah, so I was a little tired going to this race. I think um, not the cardio, just the legs are pretty worn around, like walking around all the time. But um, yeah, it's, it's not too big of a deal. I think I have time to recover for it. And um, yeah, that's what I'm looking forward for the next races. After I'm done with the recruiting, I'll just be, you know, finally rested again. Okay, well tonight, tonight a lot was at stake. You guys finished as a team second overall, mm -hmm. very pivotal today, and you ran very well finishing third overall. Congratulations, Brent Reynolds, Valencia High School.